I mean, who does that? Who does that, right? Not gonna lie, it threw me off a bit, woman in gold. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, The Elite Nurse Lifestyle, where we discuss all things fashion and most importantly, fragrances. And so today I am really excited because this fragrance house has been one of my most coveted houses that I have wanted for such a long time. This fragrance, guys, it's just very elegant, very, um, if you want to make a statement, this would be the fragrance to do so. And so I'm going to be reviewing the House of Killian Woman in Gold. This fragrance was launched in 2017 and the perfumer is Khalees Becker and it's really I find it to be very sophisticated very elegant but with a punch okay this is someone who knows what she wants um, you know knows where she's going she's not gonna take anything off anyone this is the kind of fragrance that I get but yet very sophisticated, very elegant. And the notes are um, aldehydes and citrus notes, such as mandarin orange. There is bergamot, rose, freesia. Um, there's also geranium and vanilla, tonka bean, something that's called like agarwood um, and patchouli in the base. Okay, so this is a very complex fragrance, guys. I'm not going to lie. When I first, when I sniffed this fragrance for the first time, I was like, what, what is that? Like, I couldn't put my finger on what exactly I was smelling. And um, I was like, whoa, what, what is that? You know, I was just like, I don't know if I like this one too much. You know, it's a little bit... It's throwing me off a little bit, but the more it dried down, it was just, it just developed into such like a beautiful fragrance. I love this fragrance and um, I wouldn't tell you to go ahead and blind buy this fragrance. I would say go ahead and maybe get a decant this way you can test it on your skin your chemistry and see how that works for you um the packaging hmm. oh my god let's just be clear this is the house of killian and they go all out when it comes to their packaging okay this house um when it comes to their packaging i it's like top marks for the, for for that. I'm giving it 10 out of 10, 5 out of 5, you know? And so, okay, let's get to it. So this is the box it came in. And as you can see, it says right there, Killian, uh, Woman in Gold. And the box, the back looks like that. Okay, with the barcode right there and nothing there okay so we'll open it up and it comes with this cover inside plastic foam cover and guys this is the best part here this is the case for the perfume like I mean who does that who does that right it also has like the Killian um, little card there and it says perfume as an art and just by this and the fragrance you definitely can tell it's like an it's it's art um, okay so boxes like that and then it opens up there's a mirror oops there's a mirror right there and the fragrance is in it like that and then it comes out like such 
and the box is just like this and what I have been told is that you can take this part out and you can use it for like um, you know whatever you want to I guess like um, what I would do is put like store jewelry in it you know if I if I felt like it but my perfume is gonna go in it that's where my perfume is gonna stay because this fragrance is quite pricey you guys and so the bottle looks like this lemon and gold the back I hate those um, finger marks on it the bottom is like that and you can see I still have a lot of juice inside but guys oh my god like the first opening like when you first sniff it you get the aldehydes like straight up straight away and then it's kind of creamy a little powdery and I guess that would be like the you know like the the um the jasmine and um you know the flowery notes in it oh it smells so good guys um so oh so good so yeah so as far as packaging like i said i would give it a five out of five um 10 out of 10 um longevity um i only wore it once so far and it literally was on my skin for up to 10 hours and it definitely gives you like a um the siage and project projection is really good so i would definitely say maybe go easy on the sprays don't over spray like i i tend to do like to do and i would prefer to wear this in cooler temperatures um the price guys it's it's killian you know it's over three hundred dollars but i don't know i i feel like it's it's definitely worth it you know so let me know if you are familiar with this fragrance and you know what is some of your other favorites from the house um leave me a, a, a comment leave me a note in the comment section and just um let me know if you have smelled this fragrance before and what your opinion on it is um, if you like my content please like share and subscribe and stay tuned for more